Hello guys, uh, welcome back. In this video, let's have a look on uh, this options called from mesh and to mesh. Uh, so right now I've got this uh, model which I've done from scratch and uh, I have, uh, you know, sub tools around. So I'm going to select this uh, particular sub tool. Just I hold alt and just click there. And then I can able to select that sub tool which I want to work on. So I'm just selecting that uh, sub tool. And then right now I'm in the standard brush. So I'll go to the brush menu and I'm going to clone this brush so that I'm not going to affect my original standard brush. So just hit clone that makes it a, as a copy. And once that is done, I'm going to brush and then choose uh, from mesh. Okay. So that ends up giving me a, a brush whose alpha is actually, uh, I mean, it's a normal standard brush, but this model's uh, Z image or Z depth image is now became an alpha. And then if I come here and then just uh, choose the drag rectangle, just click and drag. Maybe I'll put an intensity of 50. Then you should be able to see that alpha, that model's alpha is now, I mean, that model became an alpha and got me a brush out of it. Maybe you could uh, also try exploring that dots. Okay. And then you can uh, play with the mouse average, all that stuff. Or you can also try spray and then spray those uh, horn texture. I'll put an intensity of 15 and then I get uh, something crazy out of it. Okay. So any models uh, alpha can become a brush now. Now what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to choose a IMM brush. I'm going to select any of these IMM brushes. So let me take uh, IMM primitives maybe. Okay. And then I'm going to just clone that. So that becomes a copy. I'm going to select this particular model again go to brush and then say from mesh so now this model is one of the imm from the uh, options of uh, brushes what we have so now i can just click and drag it and then maybe i can uh, move it or placement uh, place it i mean how this uh, objects has to be modeled so that you get rightly placed in the ground and all that so you can see how imm brushes work but here uh, we are creating uh, imm brush with any one of the model from this character okay uh, so that is imm brush for you uh, then we have an option called a two mesh let me just uh, select this mesh again so we have an option called two mesh for that i'm going to select a imm brush uh, any brush should be okay so maybe i'm going to select this one so you have a lot of uh, options here so i'm going to select that and then just go to the brush and then choose this option called two mesh so, you know, you got that model as a mesh. It's not IMM, it's, it's uh, imported basically. Now I'm going to select uh, this model and then go to the append and then choose that. Now I'm going to select that model and then I can place it anywhere I wanted it to be. Okay. So it's now just like an object I'm just putting on the model there. 